Hi guys, welcome back to our show. It's me from Isabel and Lisa. Today I'm going to be showing you my cage cleaning. Yeah. I'm going to be showing you how to clean the cage and what I do. This is a really highly requested video, so without further ado, let's get on to the video. Okay, so I already have my chinchilla in his cage and I took everything out so I can just get right into it. So without further ado, let's get on to it. The first thing I do is I just like sweep everything up in here because he has a lot of hay and his food's in here. So I just uh, do that. And there's really not too, too much. Uh, but he likes to pull his hay out and stuff. As you can see, just all hay. I just made a bigger mess. Gosh. And yeah. This up. It's a big mess sometimes. Some of you ask, like, where does his like pee and poop go? Well, we have this like chicken mesh, I think it's called, and everything just goes down into this tray, and then I just dump it out at the end. And this is good lighting. And um, yeah, so it's just pretty easy. But he does go to the bathroom on these. The like little trays there, and um, he had a like mess here from his hay and stuff. And Nora likes to watch me. She's good. She likes to watch while I do the cages. So, next up is these. I have no clue what the word is. Okay, what is the word? I don't know. But <laughs> next is this. <laughs> like little lip right here and it's like hard to clean because like if he goes to the bathroom it's just really hard but I already cleaned that so now for the top one right there oh got stuck in that I barely had any that just had a couple pieces of This is all of it. It's just hay and his food. That's pretty much it. And then just now to clean the tops of those. So now what I like... Oh, I missed. Where is my paper towel? That I did not know where my paper towel Okay, back to what I was saying. Um, I... Can you... Can you... Sorry. Okay, so back to what I was saying. Um, I like to clean the boards of those just because sometimes you go to the bathroom on them. And I like to make it smell good in there, so... And this is okay for them. It's Windex. I only use a little bit. Um, and yeah. So I don't like spray the whole cage down with it because I know probably there's probably chemicals in here that could hurt him. But it's not like where he eats or anything. I don't. I with clean this. I clean this with water and um, oh, um, animal soap for them. So it's completely fine. Um, this just kills the bacteria of when he goes to the bathroom and stuff. So it helps out with that. Cage, and so what I like to do is I like to wheel it out into the other room, 
with Zoe, and I like to sweep and mop the floors. <laughs> so let's get on to that. Okay, so what I like to do is I totally forgot um, I mentioned this, but um, I like to take this thing out and. Yeah, because, as you can see, <laughs> it's pretty, uh, well, full. <laughs> yeah, it's really disgusting. Um, look at that. Like, what? Okay, so, I am taking this out to the trash cans, and as you can see, Hopefully, you can. I have this new thing, a device that I have to hold the camera because I just got it, so it's brand new. And I'm just gonna dump that. Yeah, that's disgusting. Okay. And it looked like he just peed. That's great. Okay. That's always great. So, um, yeah. Ugh. Oh, it was really hot. Okay, I'm just gonna, like, dump it pretty much. And then I'm just going to hose it down, and then I'll be back into the house. Just going to hose it down. Got to pet it. I am back in the house, and it was really hot out there. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so, as you can see, I don't know if you can see, but, oh, my gosh. That right there is all pee. You can see right there. That is all pee. And, don't forget, all over there. So, he is a boy, so he does spray a lot. And he goes to the bathroom. So I do advise you to put like plastic or something against the walls. That's what we are going to do. But we just are in quarantine so we can't really. But um, after we are able to go to stores and stuff, we are going to um, put that there. Because, yeah, uh, right now I'm just going to mop up the mess under his cage that he has there. And... Then I'm gonna mop that. Got the bucket, and I got um, soap and hair. Not plunger or anything, but I absolutely love pine salt, especially the lemon kind. It smells so good. Oh my gosh. Okay, back to this. I'm gonna put this in the right here.
bigger than my head. Oliver will be in here. One, two, three. Three. And he's back in. I'll be quiet. I've got a new cage. I have to go get his board thing so that he doesn't go to the bathroom, but he's probably trained, so. And I'll put his thing back in. And I'll be done. Okay, I've got his board and Guys, here, give him this food. I mix it with gerbil food because he likes the berries in it. I only give him a little bit because not necessarily for him, but give him that in there. Then, camera needs to like be back. There we go. What's what? Oh, this is not good. Give him these. I don't like to give him these because it isn't the best for them. Um, I give him all natural food, but, yeah. I give him, like, once of these, like, well, actually, no, I give him those twice a week because mm -hmm. sometimes I give him one, but I'll give him two. Then I give him one of these, I like this, like, the Katie brand I like, and, um, Oxbow, I like the brand of those, too. Um, these Timothy Biscuits. So, give him that. Okay, here. I'm gonna go rinse out his water. Give him fresh, not sink water. Don't give your animal sink water. Because it's bad for them. I give him bottled water, or we have um, this thing that filters water for us, and I give him that. So, don't give your animals. Oh, are you gonna say hi now? Come. Come here, baby. Oh, my God. Um, what was he saying? Oh yeah, don't give them, well, don't give them sink water, because it's not that much filtered, and you're really just supposed to use that for, like, bathing, not for drinking, so don't give them that, especially this little guy. Give him filtered water, or bottled water. Okay, got his water, and this thing, like, has this little ball in it, as you can see, I don't know, that little white circle thing. You gotta push it down, and you gotta do this very, very, very. I do it upside down over the carpet. Rug, I mean, twist your pants. Hi. Here you can see him. Okay. <clears throat> Come with that. Wait patiently, baby. Okay. You have lots of hay. I just gave you it. So he has hay. And he's done. Moving on to the gerbil. Okay, so this is Zoe's cage. As you can see, she's in the back where Oliver was in this little cage. And she wants to say hi. Say hi. Hi, baby. Um, it's a cat cage, but I use it for animals. So. This one's a lot easier than Oliver's cage because it's a lot smaller. This view is not working for me. It's there. Yeah, okay. So I take everything out. She does not like this wheel. I don't know why I put it in for her. Empty it all out. And she is potty trained. I don't know how, but she just came like that. Maybe she was already potty trained, but she goes to the bathroom in one corner. She goes to the bathroom in one corner. Okay, this is not working for me. Please stay there. Okay, I want to get my tripod because I feel like this don't work. Okay, it's gonna be a little bit taller though. Sweet. Okay, so I take all of her toys out. 
and it should be in here somewhere. Ha. One. Sometimes she likes to like put treats in them. I don't know why, but she does. What is it? Oh, her thing. I put peanut butter on this because she loves peanut butter. I give it to her once a week because it's a treat, but I put peanut butter on this little ball, wooden ball, and she licks it off. She's very weird. Zoe is definitely the weirdest pet I've ever had. She is... <laughs> I feel like there's a blue one in here somewhere. Or did I give this to all of her? Oh, and she always blocks this one tunnel. And she blocks it. Why does she do that? I don't know. Okay, so I'm just going through this. Sorry, you guys cannot see. I believe she had one more. Oh. Okay. I'm going to go dump this, and then I'll be back. I'm going to try this thing on there. Three, two, one. <laughs> I'm back. Okay. So I have her cage here. You have to see that. Chinchilla. What are you doing? Anyways, I clean the cage. You can see. It's a good thing. And so what I do is, there we go, what I do is I do half hay so that she eats it and then she goes to the bathroom in that corner and then half bedding. So I'm going to go do that really quick. And this thing fell out. There we go. I'm going to go do that really quick. One side in. That's probably not good for your teeth. One side in, other side to go. Okay, so I got that. That's what it looks like. Hay and bedding. Don't mind that mess right there. That's where she goes to the bathroom sometimes, but she hasn't been doing that in a while. That's where she pees. So let's not talk about that. <laughs> She's weird. Very weird. I don't know if it gets here right now, but that's that. <gasps> My pop socket just fell. Okay, that's it. Okay. put that. Clip. There we go. Okay. So now, I'm going to put these two in here. And put the red on the hay side and the blue on the bedding side. Then I'm going to go grab food and... Something over here. Oh, her wheel. I'm back. I got her wheel. I'm going to place that right in the center. That was her sister's, Chloe. Um, in the comments, give me a heart and say, love Chloe, because Chloe is her sister. Two years ago. She's really old, and she's still old. Okay. Feel sad. This is gonna be a good video, not a sad one. Okay, I'm gonna fill this up with her food. One. Two. Oh, this little peanut butter ball. You really want it? You little peanut butter. Well, she did have a treat the other day. No, we're not going to have it. Sorry. We're going to put this back. Okay. Comment down below, you guys, if you want to see this channel come into a uh, animals channel. Because I am coming out with a new video. I'm not going to spoil anything. But uh, I am coming out with a new video soon. But that's all I'm going to say. I'm coming out with a new channel, but it's not a new video. Duh. Um, I'm going to fill up her water, and I'm done. Okay, I got her water. I'm going to put it in. Hi, Zoe. I know, you want to go in your home. She's such a spoiled brat, though, because, like, she knows she does not like that pink carrier. Otherwise, Oliver does, because his favorite color is pink. I, I know, probably animals don't have a favorite color. But I know 110% Oliver does, because... He loves, he like, will go, go in there, even though his cage is, like, way bigger than that. And since Zoe knows that that's not her real cage, and that her cage is way bigger than that tiny little thing, she tries.
tries to get out because she knows that there's a bigger cage waiting for her. But she's like a little little rat because she knows that's not her cage and it's way too tiny for her. I don't know why. <gasps> and in she goes. Whoa! Got my camera. That's not good. Okay, the animals are done. Oliver's in there. Where'd he go? Oh, he's right there. Oliver's in there. Billy. He bit me. Did you come all the way over there to bite my little finger? And you're like, I'm going to sneak back. So that's it for you guys. That's all. That's everything. That's it, everybody. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want me to do another video like this, do like next week's video. Or comment down below if you want me to do any other thing. So without further ado, it's time to say goodbye. <laughs> This is it. Yeah. They're all back in there. And so, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below if you want me to see me any more videos. And share with your friends and family. See you guys in the next video. And stay safe and healthy. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.